In the previous tutorial, I have discussed how to create Azure DevOps pipeline without using .ml file. Now let's see how to attach the Playwright report into the Azure DevOps pipeline. So here I will navigate to the Azure DevOps. So we have created this particular pipeline. So simply I will click on this pipeline and I will edit the pipeline. So we have to add a simple task called publish pipeline artifacts. So let's click on the plus icon and search for the publish pipeline artifacts. So we have to add this particular task. That's it. And then let's select that particular task. And here we have to provide the display name. So here we'll say add playwright report. And then so here we have to provide the file name or directory path. So in our case, so we are generating the one folder called playwright hyphen report. So after the test execution is completed, so Playwright will generate the one folder called Playwright hyphen report. And simply I'm adding the that file name here. And after that, so we can provide the artifact name. So this name can be anything. That's it guys. And after that, simply you can save and queue the build. So here I will select the agent and I will save and run it. So I will open the build again. So it lists down all the tasks and it will start executing one by one all the tasks. So firstly it will install the Node.js and then it will start installing the npm and also it will install the all the Playwright browsers. So it will take a couple of seconds to install the npm as well as the Playwright browsers. So if you look at here on the right side logs, so it started installing the browsers. And now currently we are running the Playwright tests. So this particular task, it will take around 35 to 40 seconds because it contains two automation tests. One is a UI test and another one is the API automation test. So if you look at here, so it took around 30, 37 seconds and it has finished the execution. And if you look at the output also, so we have the two automation tests and those are getting passed here, right? And also our build is success. So you can check the artifact, whatever we have added from the this particular job, or also you can go to the, back to the this particular job also. You can go back and refresh this particular page. And in the related column, you will find the published item. That is the published pipeline artifact here. You can click on this particular one published item. And here you see that. So we are able to add the playwright hyphen report folder as a artifact into this particular pipeline. So you can download this particular report by clicking on this particular three dots and here you need to choose the download artifacts. So you will get the file in the format of zip. Simply you need to extract it and you can open the index.html report. And also you can open the artifacts from the job also. So if you look at here, so you need to select this particular job and on the right side, so you are seeing the one artifact. So you can click on this artifact as also it goes to the artifact section. So there you can find the whatever the attachment you have added into the pipeline. So this is how you can add the artifacts into the Azure DevOps pipeline.